As the summer heats up, car air conditioners are in full blast, and the last thing you need is for it to break down. Be sure to make sure your system is in good condition before you hit the road. As the temperatures go up and the humidity goes up, we just have a lot, see a lot of issues with people complaining air conditioners not cooling properly. Robert Kerville, the owner of Robert's Auto Repair in Lafayette, says that with the newer model vehicle, checking your AC is now impossible without the proper equipment. Just by putting free on, you could be doing more harm to your car than you think. We see that they're overcharging the system, which is worse than anything else they can do. They could do damage to the system. So just because it's not cooling as well as you would think that it should, uh, add the can of Freon is not the answer. Carvo says it's not necessarily a bad thing to get in your car and blow your air. But turning your recycling air condition button on can cool the car off faster. What that does, it actually recycles the air inside the car, which is usually once the air conditioner is cooling good, it's cooler than the outside air, so the air conditioner doesn't have to work quite as hard. Knowing how your AC system works can help you save a lot of money in the long run. It would help if you didn't hesitate to get it checked. Fails, then it could ruin your whole AC system. Whereas if you notice something not quite right and you go get it checked, it could be something as a, simple as a fuse or a bad electric fan, radiator fan or condenser fan, which could be repaired relatively cheap. Whereas if you keep running it with those parts bad, you could damage the whole system. Kerrville finished with the fact that it's only going to get hotter, so make sure that you're ready to hit the road with no AC problems. In Lafayette, Ashley Hamilton, News 15.